Right, this is a response video to Emrix. I have been having major issues with Virgin Media for like the for so many months now, it's ridiculous. I mean this is the best speed I've had for a couple of weeks now. I'm on the 30 MB package and this is the best speeds I've had for a few weeks now. After calling customer service and going through the usual routine for like a few months now, I finally got a, a date of March 2013 for repair works. Unbelievable. This is like the worst broadband service I've ever experienced. Like, I mean, I want to test it again. Let's see where we're at. It's just horrendous. Wow. Look at this. This is a 30 MB package. 30. And I'm not even breaking halfway. And what's the time? It's like 6.43 p.m. And I'm not even breaking halfway. Look at that. As for upload speeds, forget it. F absolutely forget it. The only upload they want you to do it's uploading PDF files seriously unbelievable and one thing you guys should also test as well is the, is the ping tests look at this what I just I mean how in the world do you get upload speeds this pathetic look at this no point you might as well just just take that off the cars just zero uploads can you imagine how this is in gaming like this is why I don't I, I haven't been playing that many online games because I just keep testing it and it just it's just useless and one thing you guys should also test as well is your ping tests this is the results of the last ping test I took look at this 178 millisecond jitter look at that awful look at the ping this is a disgrace like so you might be getting these fast download speeds and you're like you're thinking it's happy days but really the quality I'm talking like the quality the consistency is absolute garbage so in your games it's gonna be all over the place one minute you're gonna have like 15 ping and then the next thing you know you're, you're at a hundred it just keeps jumping a lot you just so erratic so you guys really need to check check your ping test I can't believe I've been paying for this for like so long and they just keep giving you these dates and it just keeps dragging on and now they're telling me it's March 2013 they told me March 2013 back in December this is after telling me for months that they would have it fixed by November they told me March 2013 but <laughs> during December absolutely bizarre I'm done with Virgin and hopefully I should be moving on to another service I'm not sure if that's even worth it because look the state of internet in the UK is like really bad in general it's just horrible but Virgin has just taken it to a whole new level <laughs> they just like really just outperformed any levels of incompetence set by any other company like Virgin just you know what like fellas let's go out there and let's just let's just outdo them in being crap <laughs> it's just unbelievable <laughs>